Hello Leo, welcome to my channel. My name's Catherine from Soul Siren Tarot. Okay, I'm here to do your weekly reading ahead. Okay, for the week ahead. Um, okay, it's a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with everybody, although I have empowered the deck for Leo and our spirit to give us the messages we need to hear. All right, if it resonates with you, great. I hope it helps. If it doesn't, there's no message for you today. Um, but if you if you know someone else who it might benefit, then please do share. All right. If you want a private read into your situation, description box, the details of how to do that are in the description box below. I'm doing so many readings at the moment. Honestly, my words are tumbling out. All right, without further ado, let's get on to Leo's reading. If you are enjoying this channel, all right, and you haven't already, or you're new to it, um, and, and you want to subscribe, please do. It's going to help me keep the channel running. All right, okay, let's go, Leo. Get myself comfy, Leo. Whoa, two flicks. Wow. Wow, right, Leo. Okay, this one came out first as well. In, and I'm not sure if the same one came out second in one of the earlier readings, one of the other signs feel like I want to say it was Taurus right so I don't know if there's a Taurus connection but anyway page of swords right now what I want to say to you with the page of swords can you see it's a very young like immature energy right because it's a page right and this person's swinging this sword round like Billio right they, they, they're not practiced they're not controlled yeah they don't realize who they're hurting that's what i want to say leo I feel this is someone right who's lashing at you in real life yeah injuring you hurting you right and coming next to it i've got the hanged man right absolutely similar to tor it was the same as Taurus. i'm sure they came out together and absolutely thoroughly shuffle all the cards between readings right this this is someone who's got you stuck, who's hurting you, Leo. All right. What I want to say, right, with the page of swords, it just it's like messy, right? It's messy. It's just flinging it around in all directions, catching this, catching that. You know, it might be barbed comments all the time, but they're bringing you down. They're keeping you stuck. What I want to say is, at least with the king of swords, right, in that energy, even though it can be brutal, right, it's like mercy of the swift kill, right? That's that's. That's what I'm feeling. And this person isn't, they've got you stuck and they're playing with the prey. Don't like it, Leo. And you're such a strong sign. You're so strong, Leos. You would normally put up with this. But I'm getting a sense that it kept crept up on you. Yeah, look as I said it at the bottom of the deck, King of Swords. Yeah. This is what I want you to do to this page of swords. If this person is hurting you, lashing out, yeah, cutting you, and I don't mean physically, obviously that's, that's a serious situation, violence, I'm talking about emotionally hurting your heart, yeah, saying things. This person, this energy crept up on you, you didn't see it coming. I want you to do the mercy of the swift kill for yourself and end it, right? You shouldn't be living in that energy. Obviously you've got free will. The spirit's saying, look, this isn't for your greater good. Yeah. Now, this is a new love relationship, right? So some of you may have ended this page of swords. Some of you are thinking about it. What I want to say to you is, once you free yourself from that, right, that energy, this, it allows this to come in. A divine, genuine love offer union. Yeah, it allows it in. Absolutely does. Leo, but you've got to release. You've got to, you've got to, you've got to get it out, put it out. Yeah, take it. Absolutely, what, what we've got here, it's the two of cups. Knight of Wands is charging in. Yeah, this will come in bloody quickly, right? Leo, whoever I'm connecting with right now, if you're scared that by coming out of this relationship, or you've just come out of this relationship and you're feeling like, you know, you'll never find a love relationship again, you will, and it's coming in fast. Knight of Wands sits watching for a while. Could be somebody you know, yeah, but they do sit watching for a while, and then all of a sudden they think, do you know what, I'm going after it, and that's what I'm feeling. When they see you're free and clear, free and clear, they come charging towards you. Beautiful. For Leos, please, Spirit. Leos, yes, please. Leo. Excuse me. Oh, wow. Right, now... Coming across from this page of swords, it landed reversed is the Ten of Cups, right? This person from your past, I do believe, you thought would be Ten of Cups. I believe that for a period of time, they probably were, yeah? But then the mask slipped. Leo, that's just what I'm getting. Then the mask slipped, right? They got you stuck, right? 
I do feel like I'm charging at you in this Knight of Wands energy, and that's what you're frightened of happening again. You know, how do I trust somebody new? What if I don't love somebody new because you've got you all stuck up in your head telling you no, you will find true love, Leo. Absolutely. Under this page of swords, this person, can you see it? Left you out in the cold, can you see? Yeah. They absolutely left you out in the cold. Five of Pentacles. Horrible. Horrible energy that you've been in, Leo. Look. Four of Cups. Can you see this person? Don't take the genders. It can be you can switch them around. This person sat under the tree. Yeah, they're not looking at that beautiful maiden. Yeah, that beautiful person who's offering that cup of love. They're just not looking at it. They're not accepting it. It's like a kid sulking, ignoring it. Yeah, tantruming. Is that what you are? Determined to come out under the hanged man. Yeah, it's no longer at the bottom of the deck. It's come out. Wanted to show itself on the actual board. Absolutely, Leo. You can get away from this. You know what you're doing. You know what you know how to put this, Leo. You've just got to get back into your power. You absolutely have. I keep getting mercy of the swift kill. I do. Don't know why I'm getting that, but that's what I'm getting. I want you to just for your own soul, yeah. I don't care about them. This person who's doing this, I have no interest in people like that who, who hurt other people. Absolutely no interest in it. But I want you to to save your soul and end it. Look, here we go. Illusions, seven of wands. This person was creating illusions, yeah, pretending to be someone that they didn't turn out to be, and that's hard. But Leo, whoever I'm connecting with now. You know, the minute you slice that energy out of your life, you will start to glow again. Absolutely broke your heart, this person. And you're frightened of that happening again. Don't stay in that energy, though. Just don't. Just know, even if you can't quite believe it right now, just know that the minute you start to pull out of this energy, you will absolutely start to glow. You will heal. The healing will begin. Absolutely. Absolutely. Look. You turn your wheel. Wheel of the Year here in, in, in um, this Wiccan deck, but it's absolutely the Wheel of Fortune. It's turning the wheel, getting your energy, your healing, yeah, aligned to the seasons, looking at all your available cup, pentacle, wand, sword. You'll know when to draw each one, yeah, a bit like the Empress, yeah, you'll just know. Absolutely beautiful. Powering towards your Ace of Pentacles, yeah. Ten of Cups reversed to the Ace of Pentacles. Are you joking? That is just amazing. Growth, abundance. Look at all the light in that card, Leo. Look at all the light in that card. That's where you're going. That's where you're going. Once you clear this energy, do you feel you're still stuck in it with the hangman being here? And I want you, I want you to clear yourself, yeah? Does it mean to say, right, if you're in a long-term relationship or there's children or there's you know, you can't obviously, there's a responsibility. So it's easy for me to sit here and say, just clear yourself. I know that, I know there's things to be done and there's, there's, there's a pattern, but I want you to start thinking about getting one foot ahead and how you will eventually get into this energy. But if you're stuck in it for now, how you will protect your soul against it and start to see it for what the fuck it is. It's abuse. Divine masculine feminine energy. Going through that transformation, can you see the butterfly coming out of its pupa, metamorphosis, transforming? Come out of it. You're not a caterpillar, Leo. You're a butterfly. Get flying. Absolutely. Right, it's determined to come out. It's telling me. Yeah, it's told me to take all of these. Got cards repeating. First of all, though, I've got the um, Eight of Swords. Right, web of deceit. Feeling trapped, stuck. What we were just talking about. How do I get out? Feeling like you can't because you're bound. You're blindfolded. You don't know where you're going. Look, this maiden can easily get out of these bones. She can easily take that blindfold off and she can walk through those swords. She's not as stuck as she thinks she is. That's the message I get with this card. You can get away from this page of swords, this five of pentacles. You absolutely can. Wanted to show itself on the actual board. Yeah, ace of wands. Divine feminine, divine masculine energy coming together. Divine union. Yeah, yeah metamorphosis the butterfly flying yeah getting in the right energy fields coming here nine of wands yeah you know it's going to be a long battle but you've done most of it now you're already on the other side of the eight you're holding one up across your chest getting ready to do your final moves yeah that's what we've got here going on here leo you are doing it you're not seeing in this energy anymore yeah you know you know you've still got a bit to go 
you know there's still that final battle if you like that final push but you're doing it nine of wands is stunning yeah absolutely stunning when you get to the 10 completion yeah you've done the work then we get this after you walk away right from this bad energy that's not serving you well guess what shows itself again wanted to repeat come on the board the wheel of fortune yeah eight of cups walk away what comes after the eight of cups is the nine of cups which is wish fulfillment wheel of fortune wheel of the year yeah absolutely stunning leo but you've got to do it whoever i'm connecting with right now do not stay in that brutal energy start planning your exit start planning how you protect your soul getting out of this energy yeah this ten of cups reverse we're not staying there we're going out into the light ace of pentacles here yeah from that i mean look at that energy look what's mirroring yeah that's where this person has you that's where you're living now or you're just about escaping that's where you're going and it's like a big wheel of fortune itself isn't it and the wheel of fortune landed over it after this can you see the power ten of cups reverse wheel of fortune ace of pentacles that's where you're going all right leo after we get rid of this absolutely stunning reading today leo okay take care you're strong you know you're strong can't believe what's at the bottom of the deck the world completion yeah everything you want coming your way all the rewards from spirit because you do the work absolutely stunning all right leo know you can do this yeah take care yeah move yourself into the better energy into the light you know what you deserve who i'm connecting with right now all right hope this reading helped if you do want a reading specific to your situation details on how to book that are below other than that my darling people I'll see you either in the weeklies or dailies. If you did enjoy the reading, please do subscribe to the channel if you've not already. All right, thank you so much, Leon.